on this episode of the You Can Guitar Core Dictionary, we will be talking about the A7 chord a different way, or you can also call it the A with the G bass. Side right now for some fresh air, but we will do our dictionary inside. Let's get started. Okay, now for the ukulele. So it's basically the G chord on the ukulele, which is the same as the D chord on the guitar, like this, but it's shifted down to the fourth and fifth frets right here. And you have this G, this, so this one will play the note G and then you have the A chord on the other th the other th three strings. So it's basically an A with a G bass, or you can just do consider it an A7, like this. And of course, as you can see, it's it's not. It's kind of, it's really good to put this as the chord right before the tonic. So in this case, you have this A7 to a D chord. Now, if you don't know what, if you don't know what I just did here, it's the, the, the D chord on the ukulele, go back to my, one of my other videos, I have a playlist and I will make sure to link the playlist below in the description below. So you'll, you'll have all of my chord dictionary videos. But the, to review, the D chord is basically, you have three fingers on the second fret and you, you start on the fourth string down to the second string. An alternate way would be to bar the second fret and then have your pinky on the fifth fret. In fact, this, with this basic thing, you can slide it anywhere and, and have a full on major chord. D chord, E chord, F chord. So that's the alternate D chord. So you might, so here's how it will sound like. progression like that. Of course you can use any strumming pattern, it'll always work. But this is the A7 chord on the ukulele. Now let's go to the guitar. Okay, for the guitar it's a little bit harder. Now to play the A, the A major chord, let me get my pick. Oh, to play the, the A major chord, you just play. Forgot to tune that, but anyway. Sorry about that, my iPhone storage was 
almost full, so I had to free up some storage. Anyway, so the way to do A7 is basically the A chord. Based, so you have, it's similar to the D chord on the ukulele, except it, yeah, it's a, except it's starting on the fourth fret. I mean, get to where you can see it. So all you need to do for the A7 is you only need your fingers to press down on the fourth and the second strings on the second fret. That's A7. You can also do the A chord with a G bass. So you have your pinky or your ring finger on the third fret, sixth string. And then you play, and then of course you play the A2 chord, which is basically the, which is what most guitar players play the A chord. Have, yeah, to have two fingers on the second fret. Starting on the fourth and third strings. And to do this, the, the same chord progression, you start with, so I'll, I'll just play it. And of course, the tonic is D. Same thing in for theory wise, just place that put that chord right before the tonic. So that's all I have for this episode of the Ukulele Guitar Chord Dictionary. Comment down below any chords that you want to learn on the guitar or the ukulele or both. And I'll see you in my next dictionary video. Bye!